What's up, boo? So this one is, I don't know what to call this video, but I am just so sick and tired. And I'm just gonna tell you how I feel. And hopefully that you can relate to it and it gives you refuge and I don't know, anything at all. But anyways, I just came off of set. For you, set could be either work or school or dance or anything like a basketball extra extracurricular activities but i just finished my day it was 10 hours woke up early um and it started off pretty good but it's just for me when i'm not productive doing something that I love to do I get so drained and I get so exhausted and it's so annoying and you're just surrounded by people who try and tell you what to do and it's like don't get me wrong I, I, I love being in film I love working I love like being an actor today I was a background actor and what I want to talk to you guys about is being sick and tired. Because if it wasn't for today, I wouldn't have to stop and reflect and, I don't know, I just really was so mad because I mean, I, I was working, right? I was working and I was I was doing the scene, but it, it's it's different when you you want to be in front of the camera like I am right now, and then you're in the background. You know, it's just it's really not the same. You know, when you see somebody who has the the thing that you want, you know, like. I want to be the actor. I want to be the person who's doing the scene. Like, you mess up your lines. I know all of your lines, you know? Like, why do we have to keep on repeating the same thing? And then here I am. I'm just trying to chase my own dream. And it just sucks, you know? Like, and all I wanted to do was to, like, edit a video just to post it for you guys and do things that I want to do, but I was, I felt like I was trapped, I was stuck there, you know, just as a pawn, just like in the back, and I, I get it, it's like, it's, you have to start somewhere, right, but today was just especially hard, and then, so I went through the day, and, like, I mean, I shouldn't even com be complaining because, like, everybody was so nice. Everyone was there, you know? I mean, like, it wasn't all bad. Like, we did have fun, you know? But, like, I feel better when I'm, like, doing things that I want to do, you know? Not just doing something for somebody else, you know? I keep saying, you know, but <laughs> do I really know what I'm talking about right now? I don't know. What I do know is that it. I'm probably gonna watch this tomorrow and think that I'm crazy, and or maybe I'll stay up all night trying to figure out what kind of goals I want to do because this isn't working for me, you know. Like it's not fair for me to to be in the background when I want to be in the front. It's, it's super painful. But anyways, so we finished the scene. They asked me to stay a little bit longer, and so I did. 
And then my beautiful girlfriend picked me up and she had a rehearsal, so I waited for her. And I was scrolling on Instagram, trying to find an answer to like why or find like a meme or something to cheer me up. And then, <clears throat> I check up on my um, my little Instagram group, and I haven't been active on it for like a day or two because I've been busy working. And I find out that my friend Cat got diagnosed with cancer. sucks. I didn't even know how to feel or act. She got diagnosed on Friday and she let us know today that she has cancer. And it's like, what am I even complaining about, you know? It's just not fair. So, gotta figure out what I want to do, <clears throat> you know, and just like my girlfriend reminded me, I just gotta keep working hard, just gotta work harder, you know? But what I won't do is I won't sit here feeling sorry for myself. And I won't sit here just being mad, you know, making excuses. Not gonna I'm not gonna waste this life that I have, you know, just to give this message to you guys. I know it sucks and I know it's not fair and life is not easy, but one thing that I'll never do is I'll never give up. So if you're watching this, cat uh, I s strongly, strongly, strongly send out my prayers to you and your family and I hope that you're doing well. <clears throat> I really, really wish you the best and I hope that they can find a, some sort of treatment or anything just to make it go away or make it a little bit better. I don't even know. I just pray that you stay strong and know that we love you so much. And thank you for, for not giving up. Now, I'm not going to give up, and I hope that you guys don't give up. You know? We're going to stay strong together. And, yeah. That's all you can do, you know? I know it sucks, but... I always say that I'm, I'm always happiest when I'm working my hardest, you know? But it, it just feels so much harder when it's not something that you love to do, you know? It's just like, I literally was on set doing something I I wasn't uh, I don't want to be there and I was I, like, what made a hundred bucks a hundred fifty dollars like what is that I could be editing I could be doing something I could be learning something I could be growing I could be reading but you know what at least I have this life and I have this chance and I get to do what I want to do every single day and I have people around me that love me and 
it's gonna be okay. And I promise you that I'll never give up. And I hope that you guys don't give up. And I, I'll always be here for you. You can talk to me in the comments or DM me. And know no matter what, you'll always be my boo. And with that being said, I love each and every one of you. I hope that I get to see you guys soon. Oh, I will see you soon because I make videos every single day. And it's going to be different from now on. I really, truly believe that. So. With that being said, I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace, homies. Bye, boo.